If you like math, enjoy solving problems, have a curiosity for how things work around us, then a career in ECSC could be for you. Electricity really is everywhere. Studying electrical engineering or computer systems engineering will really give you a foundation that enables you to work in most of the major technological industries that exist today. You can basically go into almost any engineering position as an electrical engineer and find a use for you. One of the things that I think is important about ECSE is developing a wide range of multidisciplinary skills and being able to understand what mechanical people are talking about even if you're an electrical engineer or understand what the software does, even if you're not the programmer. My favorite experiences were the really hands-on stuff, doing labs, classes where at the end of the class, you could make your own with really open-ended projects. From hardware development to computer vision and robotics, uh, and being exposed to that, I narrowed down what interests me. I really did at math, and I really wanted to keep doing math. And um, from there, I see, okay, what path do I take that kind of like hands-on, but also applies a lot of math to it. We hand-built sensors that were connected to each other and also connect to the internet. I got to help write and design lab assignments, publishing papers into journals, which is something I got to do in research. I really just had a lot of autonomy during uh, the research, so I could kind of explore and learn as I was going. And that was really fun, really got to get my hands dirty with building a robot from scratch. Those were all really fun, really great experiences, and I will remember all of those robots forever. It's a challenging program, and it pushes you to learn a lot. And I feel like once you do this program, everything else after that is gonna be much easier because you've already learned it, like up front. Not just how do I get this to work, but why do things work? One of the things I am very proud of is just like, I know how to ask questions and so when they ask you like, hey, do you have any questions? I know how to like extend the interview for another 30 minutes. So just me talking to the person interviewing me. You're gonna be working on electronics or embedded hardware. Everything you need is there. I just really liked everyone who taught me and it created an environment that I think was easier to learn in. Wiring a circuit board, writing a little bit of code, working with PID controllers, and doing a wide variety of things, putting it all together, and final project. That's what really taught me the skills I needed to become the engineer that I am now.